Hi, welcome to my channel. This is Kauser Wise and this is the continuation video of ratio analysis. In the previous videos, we have seen six different calculations under turnover ratios. You can find the playlist link in the description box. Now, in this video, we are going to see fixed asset turnover ratio. Okay, see the problem. Following is the balance sheet of Alston Limited as on 31st December 2022. See the balance sheet, asset side, fixed assets, stock, debtors, cash. Liability side, share capital, debentures, creditors. Okay, now see the adjustment. Sales for the year were 15 lakhs. With this information, they are asking you to calculate fixed asset turnover ratio and provided they have given the GP ratio. Gross profit ratio is 25 percentage. Okay, now see the calculation. This is the formula to find out fixed asset turnover ratio. The formula is cost of sales or sales divided by net fixed asset. Okay, so in your problem, if you have only sales, in that case, you can calculate this formula on sales. The formula is sales by net fixed asset. Suppose if there is any gross profit given in the problem, in that case, you can calculate cost of sales. What is the formula for cost of sales? Sales minus profit. Okay. Then you can calculate cost of sales. In that case, the formula will be fixed asset turnover ratio on cost of sales is equal to cost of sales divided by net fixed asset. Okay. How to calculate net fixed asset? Total fixed asset minus in case of any depreciation given in the problem, just subtract. Otherwise, you can take the total fixed asset as net fixed asset okay now see the problem here we have sales for the year how much 15 lakhs and fixed asset 8 lakhs so there is no depreciation in this problem now you can calculate fixed asset turnover ratio on sales first sales how much 15 lakhs divided by net fixed asset how much 8 lakhs answer is 1.9 times you can round up the figure okay now we are going to calculate the same thing on cost of sales okay so what is the formula for cost of sales sales minus profit see the problem sales for the year were 15 lakhs gp ratio that is gross profit ratio is 25 percentage so 25 percentage on sales is profit so minus profit from sales you will be getting cost of sales Okay, so calculate GP. How much? 25 percentage on sales? No. So GP is equal to sales 15 lakhs into GP ratio 25 percentage. 3 lakhs 75,000. This is gross profit. So minus gross profit from sales, you will be getting cost of sales. Okay, 15 lakhs minus GP. Divided by net fixed asset, same, 8 lakhs. So, sales minus GP, you will be getting cost of sales. How much? 11 lakh 25,000. Divided by 8 lakhs. What is the answer? 1.4 times. Okay, so this is the way to calculate fixed asset turnover ratio on sales and fixed asset turnover ratio on cost of sales. Okay. The remaining part we will discuss in the next video. You can find the playlist link in the description box. Hope you like this video. Please hit the like, comment, subscribe and share with your friends. Thank you.